Alright boys, and today we're gonna be trying to make it to round 100 on hard mode with the worst card in the game. And we are also going to be using no heroes at all. Alright, so personally, I honestly think the Dart Monkey is the worst card in the game. Just because everything else has so many, like, abilities that add to the card. Like, the Boomerang Monkey, it's like things go in a swirl, which can pop multiple balloons. But the Dart Monkey, all he gets is one little dart, and it's really bad. So, let's just start off right here, because it gets most of the beginning of the track. And honest, look, see, already he's try he's failing on round one. It's really bad, but hopefully we're gonna be able to succeed because I haven't beat this map before, so I don't really know the best spots, but I bet I can do it. One of the worst things about the Dart Monkey is its upgrades. To be able to pop lead balloons, I have to get to upgrade three, and to be able to pop camo balloons, I have to be upgrade two. Uh, two. So it just takes a while for the Dart Monkey to actually get decent. I'm instantly right off the bat gonna go for a crossbow because these are my favorite in the game. Crossbow's just really good and I honestly think they're better. I honestly think that the crossbow's better than all the other paths for the dart monkey because it shoots through balloons making it be able to pop more. And then I'm also just gonna go for a triple shot on this dart monkey just to try and take care of these balloons in the early waves and save up my money. I'm gonna get sharp shots on this before so that then one shots all these balloons and then we can go for the triple shot. We got the triple shot. Look how yeah, this thing's overpowered. It's really good for the starting waves, but the further and further you get, it's really bad. We're also gonna go for the razor sharp shots just so it insta pops the green balloons. I'm honestly just gonna go for a uh, Ulta Juggernaut because they're super cheap. Uh, unlike the Plasma Monkey Club and the Crossbow Master, but after this, I really have to rely on the Super Monkey Fan Club just to be able to pop the higher round balloons. So I'm gonna put the, uh, Ultra Juggernaut up here so it shoots down the lane, and we're gonna put it on last so it doesn't start shooting up here, but rather shooting down here. I honestly think that's better. And it's the top path, and I think I'm gonna go with, uh, huh, I'm gonna go with the bottom path, so then it also hits camos when it, when the camo leads come out. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Alright, so these two monkeys have just carried us to round 20 already. These guys are really good, like I've said. This guy's had, yeah, like I've said, this is better. Oh yeah, look at this, because it swerves back to the other balloons. Which is crazy, but we're definitely gonna go for Juggernaut next because it's super helpful. Now we get Juggernaut, which is crazy helpful. So I don't think anything's gonna be getting past this. But now we gotta start focusing on the Moab, and to do that, I honestly think we're gonna go for Sharpshooter because of all the crits that it does, which is gonna be able to destroy the Moab. So I'm definitely gonna start putting these guys down. More crossbows. You just focus on these because then they'll shoot down the line again, which is really good for the pierce that it has. Oh, yep, that's where that came in clutch because we would have lost right there because there was lead balloons. I don't know if I should go for sharp shots or quick shots. I really don't know which is better. And just like normal, the juggernaut's messing it up. But should I go for the? I think quick shots. I think that's better. Let's just do that. I might also just put down another spike pole, like right here, just so that it reaches more lead balloons, just in case. And then we're gonna go bottom path, so then it has more range, like this. But now I really need to get a sharpshooter before we get smacked. I don't think this dart monk, this this guy is doing that much anymore, so I might sell him soon just for the money, because that's an honest good amount of money. Yeah, so these sharpshooters are really just, well, now I got a sharpshooter. Let's put on the bottom guy. Yeah, the crits are really going to start helping us, but look how fast it shoots. It's also just crazy damage with the crits. And then we got the juggernaut to take care of the leads. I think we got a pretty good squad going on right here. 
And now I'm going to get this sharpshooter right here. And then this should be able to take down the Moab pretty easily. And now I'm going to start going for another Juggernaut right here. Alright, so the Moab is going to be coming next round. And I honestly think we're going to be able to take care of it because of our two sharpshooters. Yeah, and the crits are going to deal damage to them. And boom, just like that, it's def destroyed. But we also are going to need another Juggernaut. Just because of how overpowered they are for the lead balloons and i think we need it i should have put it like right here so just literally shoot straight down there i might honestly just do that really quick yeah i'm just gonna put him right here give him long range and then juggernaut that I put that on lap close oh wait no last and boom i'm pretty sure that's better now we're gonna upgrade this a sharpshooter just so we have it and I don't know if we should start going for Middle Path, Super Monkey Fan Club, or Sharpshooters for the higher round balloons. I think we might honestly have to go for the Sharpshooters because later on, when the DDTs come, they're enhanced eyesight. And we're going to need tons of power to break them. So we're going to go for that. Shoot, sadly we can't fit any right there, which would be really good, but it's whatever this extra range yeah that's good and then we're just gonna go for the same thing just like this this and this yeah that's perfect all right now we're gonna go for all the quick shots all of them just because I'm pretty sure it's the better better way to go Yeah, did you guys see that mob get destroyed? This is definitely the way that, that we should be going. Alright guys, so I just remembered that a DDT is a camo lead balloon. Which means we have to, one of our things has to be camo and lead. So honestly, I, we're going to have to put down a village later on at like round 90 or whatever they come in. Just to stop the DDTs. And then, but y'all have to understand that I can, it's literally impossible without the monkey village. So we're going to put down that village just to be able to help us actually be able to beat the game. But no other firepower, okay? It's just the, it's just these guys. I also have enough for the ultra juggernaut. And I'm going to put it on the, I'm going to put it on the closer guy. Just because it's pretty overpowered just for the beginning but now i'm definitely going to be going for a crossbow mastery on two of my guys because i have the monkey knowledge and that's definitely gonna save us a lot all right guys the next tier is coming soon so let's do this yep there she is and boom the sharpshooters absolutely destroy it now we just need some crossbow mastery that's going to save us Almost done. We're more than halfway there. I think we're gonna be able to do this. But sadly, we have to use a monkey village, but that's but only for DDTs, and that's it. We're not using any other firepower, so we'll be fine. Closing in on the crossbow mastery, but balloons are starting to get past on us, and I don't really know what it is, but I think we're fine until I get the crossbow mastery. Yeah, because now the harder balloons are coming, but we'll be fine. Yeah, this Ultra Juggernaut's putting in work. I didn't expect it to be that good. I honestly thought it was pretty bad, but it's showing me up. Yeah, it's absolutely just shredding the Moabs. Yep, we're just shredding all these armored Moabs and the normal Moabs. We're fine. We're closing in on the Crossbow Mastery, which is definitely going to help us a lot. This is honestly going better than I thought. Round 70. Alright, so I'm going to get this. And then I honestly don't know when when DDTs come. So next I have to get the MIB. Or we're just going to lose because of the DDTs. And honestly, y'all have to... I'm sorry, but y'all have to go with it. Because if we don't get this, then we lose no matter what. So let's get the Crossbow Mastery. And this literally reaches the very beginning of the start. Which is insane. This is definitely worth it. We could get another one because of my monkey knowledge, but we have to go for this just so we don't lose. I'm not even, I'll, I'll look, I'm not even going to go for jungle jumps. I'm literally just going to go for this. I'm going to go for a bigger radius 
so it gets more monkeys, obviously. But that's it, I promise. We're just doing this so we don't lose. Yeah, this guy is absolutely just shredding everything, man. They can't get past nothing. And we're almost there to MIB, so... We're just gonna keep pushing it a little bit more. Yeah, look at look at it just getting destroyed. We're fine. We got this. I don't know. I know this. Oh yeah, so we got the MIB now. But I honestly, I know this is gonna be able to beat the ZOMG, but I don't know if this is gonna be able to beat the bad. I really hope because then the whole challenge is ruined. But hopefully, because that would be a really fun and amazing. I doubt it though. But we're almost there. Let's just keep pushing. We can get crossbow mastery next. But yeah, let's keep going. Honestly, let's just sell this guy. He's not doing anything for us now because of this guy. And just a little bit more money. Yeah, the combo of these two guys are insane. I honestly, it's really amazing. Let's just keep pushing. I'm gonna put more in here, more uh, more sharpshooters after I get the next crossbow master. But we just gotta keep pumping, man. And look, the ZOMG's next. So, yep, this is the last one, and then we're gonna go against the ZOMG. Let's do this, guys. Um, so this guy's shooting off the Stark and tons of crits. This guy's shredding it down. Come on, come on. Yep, that's light work. I don't know about the bad, because that's three of those, but hopefully we can make it. Yep, let's keep going. Free play. Understood. Let's go. Alright, we got enough for the crossbow mastery, and yep, this gets the star. This gets technically the same range as this guy, which is amazing. But now we're literally just going to start stacking on sharpshooters before we lose. I, I really hope this is enough. I hope we be, are able to beat this, but now we just gotta find out if we're able to beat this. We're just gonna try and get everything in the range, and now we just gotta pray. <laughs> Damn, that doesn't get it. Damn, none of that gets it. Four, a zero, four, two, a zero, two, four, zero, two, four. Damn, I got a lot of money. All right. Then we should just start stacking. And if we die to DDT, I will buy a continue and then place down another monkey village and see how that works. But honestly, now we just kind of got to wait. I'll keep placing these guys down, but now it's just up to if we can do it, if the dark monkeys can do this or not. Which hopefully they can. Looks, we're gonna, looks like we're going to find out. Yeah, they're just absolutely destroying every armored thing, which is really good. I'm going to get rid of this guy because he hasn't done anything since the start. Yeah, and honestly, I'm just going to put another village down here. Just so it could get to all of these guys. Oh, really? There's no space? Wait, can I get... I'll just do it right here. Bigger radius. Get these four. That might be everything. Start stuff starting to get a little bit further, getting a little bit scary, but I think we can do this. Yeah, like those are the DDTs. I hope everyone saw that, but we actually beat some DDTs, so that means these guys are putting in the work. I don't know if we should start changing stuff to strong or whatever, but honestly, this is just up to if we can do it now or not. I honestly don't know if we can do this. Because stuff's- Oh, stuff's gonna do them really far to the end! We're gonna put this guy on the front. Front. If anything gets passed. Then we're gonna put some more of these down here. That gets a range of the MIB. Like this. So more DDTs. Yep, there's, there's the DDTs. Oh my god. I don't know what's happening. Yes. We're, we're doing it. Alright, round 98 is insanely hard, so if we can do that, then we win, for sure. But we just have to do that. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's so close. It's so close. I, This is getting really close. I don't know if we're going to be able to do this or not. Let's pray. Oh 
Okay. Round 97. Alright, we're gonna stop the round after this. Because we really need to... We really just need to... Get ready. I think it's round 98. It, it might be round 99. We're definitely gonna keep all this stuff on first. Alright. Let's, let's try and get some of these guys in this range of this MIB. And I guess we just have to go for it. So, let's see. We gotta get some more money. Okay, come on. Come on, come on, come on. We're doing decent. Oh my god, I don't know if we did this or not. Oh, we definitely don't do this. <laughs> oh, damn, man. Alright, so our most pop monkey was five, a half a million pops, which is crazy. And, I mean, we almost did it, guys, but next time we're going to try a different monkey and see if we can do it with them. Thanks, Thank you guys for watching, and see you guys next time.